Hey guys, how's it going? Today we're taking a look at the brand new fifth generation iPod Touch and I managed to get my hands on a 32 gig model in white. If you guys want to see my previous video, I'll be posting a link around here. They'll showcase the black model in 64 gigs if you guys are interested in a little comparison. But about the new iPod Touch, it's rocking the new A5 chip which has two times the processing power as well as seven times the graphic capabilities. So getting to the unboxing, we have a bonjour from Apple saying hello. And also we have the brand new lightning connector. And that's definitely a big improvement over the last generation of the 30 pin connector that we've all grown so much to love and hate. And also we have a new wrist guard and that will obviously go around your wrist or your ankle or whatever uh, body part you wanna put this around. I guess your iPod doesn't uh, get lost. And lastly, we have Apple's brand new uh, ear pods, and these are definitely another improvement over the last generation of headphones that give better sound quality to the listener for the music. Getting to the actual iPod itself, removing the plastic, we see that iconic white plastic color that Apple has been so famous for. And on the back, we can see that it's finished in a uh, light titanium color, and this is actually in uh, anodized aluminum. So finally, Apple is getting rid of that chrome that's so prone to scratching on all the previous gens of the iPod. But we're gonna put this down for a sec and we're gonna take a closer look at the rest of the features and how the backing of this iPod actually looks like. So after about two minutes, I'm fully connected with my Apple ID and my new iPod Touch is ready to rock and roll you can see that it has Siri integrated into it, which means it has iOS 6 right out of the box. It also has that four inch retina display screen, which is the exact same as the new Apple iPhone 5. On your left hand side of the device, it has the volume rocker as well as on the top, it has the sleep button. And taking a look at the other side and the backing of the device, it's wrapped in that aluminum atomized finish. We have the iSight five megapixel camera that can record in HD 1080p video. And finally on the bottom we have the headphone jack as well as the lightning connector. So let me guys know what you think about this new iPod Touch at around 300 bucks for a 32 gig model. This isn't exactly the cheapest thing out there, but post down below. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please thumbs up, do subscribe. Hopefully you enjoyed this one and I'll catch you guys later.